I get passionate when people don't fucking see the writing on the wall. Like, it's there. It's right there. It's like hieroglyphics. Just figure it out. But whatever. All right. Noriega is called out after describing a number of Wu-Tang Clan affiliates as flunkies. I would call Nori and ask him about this. But Nori is a professional podcaster who would never give the scoop on another podcast, especially once he said he's going to divulge it on his podcast. So I'll let him do that. Uh, here's the situation. Savon, you know who made this situation come to be? The Monopoly gods. Honestly, I'm not joking. I know you think I'm nuts. This is what I mean about the Monopoly gods. Mickey Fax goes on Drink Champs. He does an interview with uh, whoever else would be. I don't know. Uh, Nori, being the great potter he is, asks Mickey about the infamous night where I get punched in the face at Rock the Bells in 2011, whatever year that was. I try, try to forget the details when I get punched in the face. Uh, and Mickey gets to talking about it. And he gets to talking about it, and, and he probably gets lost in the moment. But in his explanation, he is explaining verbatim, literally, that when this event happened, nobody had a proper understanding of how the Internet worked. Nobody. Live streaming, fans saying something. He's, just, he's literally saying this in the interview, and he's right. Nobody was doing none of that goofy shit but me back then. And when I was doing it, niggas was looking at it, calling me a goof. Mm -hmm. So as he's telling the story of me getting punched in the face and immediately jumping on live stream, they somehow get to my apology to Raekwon. Which to me, at the time, there's fucking six of y'all niggas in here, y'all huge. You're telling me to say sorry about some shit. I'm just saying, nigga, say whatever. I'm say sorry to this white paint. Well, just a sorry to the TV. Sorry to this, sorry to, hey, my son learned how to say goodbye, and now it's bye to everything. Bye-bye, pee-pee. Bye-bye, camera. Bye-bye. <laughs> it's bye-bye. Bye. Like, that's what it was then. Hey, who you want me to say sorry to, dog? Let's get it all out of the way. I don't give a fuck. Six of y'all. Right, but he's telling that story. And he says, that happened because Joe said some shit, and I didn't know how it worked, and I laughed in the background, and it appeared to be a cosign, and I was in it from that point on. He told that story. Nori made a joke about Sons of Man, Shaheen the Rugged Child, uh, Killer Army, all of the Wu affiliates. Shout out to the Wu affiliates because I was raised on y'all too. Grave diggers. I did it all. I did it all. And in that, Nori makes a joke and Mickey Fax laughs. <laughs> he laughed. He adds to it. He Wait, to it. just two seconds ago, you told me. What happened 10 years ago? You were aware of it. You acknowledged it. And then you fucking did it again. Save on. That's the Monopoly gods. He didn't even realize that that's what happened. Reason. He didn't get it. Shout out to Mickey Fax. Shout out to uh, all the Wu-Tang. Shout out to Nori. Not only did he not get it, but here's the plot twist. Here's the kicker. Just because I can say something don't mean you can say something. I know it sounds unfair. That's just what it is. I won't waste y'all time giving y'all Nori, Noriega's hip-hop jacket and non-hip-hop jacket. But it's Queen's filled with hit records and weapons that's there if he feels like he wants to say something about somebody else with hit records and weapons then he will fair fight amongst gods mm -hmm. Mickey facts know what you don't have Hit records, Hit records and weapons. weapons. <laughs> I'm not trying to be funny here. Nah, I'm not I'm trying to all. play him. Nah, That's serious. my man, and I love what he's doing. But my man can make a joke if the wrong nigga laugh. That's right. It's coming his way. It's always been that way. It's coming his way. Yeah. Ish can say what he, Ish, Hey, they say it all the time reading the car. Ish call that nigga bitch ass nigga. Ish, I know I love when he do that. You do it. <laughs> not the same. It's not true. 
Hey, uh, Charlemagne Baby interview. Classic Breakfast Club interview. 10 million views. Charlemagne said, hey, you ain't saying that to such and such. No, I'm Baby saying, said, I'm saying no, it to you, nigga. I'm saying it to you. <laughs> That's real. These rules never changed. Mickey, I hope you don't have to learn this lesson anymore. I read your apology. I saw the, I saw the apology. Round of applause. You did the right thing. That's what you should do. Too often in hip hop, I just said it. We make a mistake. We don't come out and say, hey, I made a mistake. That was wrong. I fucked it up. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I applaud Mickey Fax apologizing in this scenario. Hey, Savon, if you didn't believe in the Monopoly gods, this is why you believe in them. Know what happened two weeks before this? Shaheem was in your face. Unannounced. Didn't know. I had no idea. No idea. I didn't plan that. Separation. The 180 degrees. What are they? Six degrees. The six, six degrees. Sometimes less than Shot it. Uh, Shaheem was in our phone. Look at Shaheem. Let's get the fuck out of here. <laughs> Motherfucker. Shaheem was in our face. And not even three weeks later, deja vu happens. I believe in them. Not me. That's all I'm saying. That's all I'm saying. Uh, come, let, no, I, I say, ice, yo. This man, is we are talking. We, I'm, but listen I'm to me. You get ice. your listen shit off, no, and then I have something to say. But listen to me. Ish builds houses. This is all music. Nah, this, this is not two music. Man this ain't weave. music, right? Yeah, this isn't music. And I guess you're right. This is lifestyle. This is, this is life. This is lifestyle. You're right. This is life. What I was gonna say is, does anybody well, know that Shaheem just yeah. came home recently? Like, that's the other part about hip hop. Like we be talking about niggas, we don't really know. Like we, we don't nah. really know. What's a, and, like and y'all I, don't know. I was going into that. Ask that nothing. Like nah, I was going nothing should have told Mickey facts that this was the person to say but something I'm, about. But, like back in the day with me, Joe Budden. Anyone but Method Man. <laughs> here's the thing. Here's Anybody the thing. else here's on the, the list. Look, 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 here's the thing. You don't have to live like I don't that. Think, I don't think Mickey Fax goes in there I and does that. I didn't know. You ever saw a Method Man in a show? He's 6'6". Six, six. He's like 6'4". Six, 6'4". <laughs> I'm telling you something. Nah, he's 6'4". He's nah. in his 50s. He works out. He nah. don't stop. All his records is classic when he play them. His hair makes him taller. He's with 70 niggas. He's compassionate. His arm length is long. Like, I'm telling you what you... Like, nah. You it, ain't a, it ain't a... It wasn't that with you. Fam, anybody nah. else. Yeah, he was loved, too. Well, that's like the nigga thing. don't bother well, that, nobody. That's the thing. That's the Niggas thing. That's ain't, the most he ain't no part. beefer nigga. That's the most important Meth part. Meth is just a loved, funny, cool, suave, charismatic cat. Fast forward, same thing. We thought that Shaheem was the young Meth. Mm -hmm. They was always, it was always Shaheem Meth. And here we are now. Who the hell has Shaheem ever said something about? Yeah. That'd be the thing. Like He couldn't have said nothing about y'all because he was in jail. No. He wasn't here. <laughs> That'd be the then he came home peaceful and gracious. Yo, trying to get this shit together. Pod, peace, love, light. But this is when you know you're dealing with different people. Different Mickey Fax said that shit. And Shaheem said, not only do you owe a public apology, hit us to negotiate the fee that we want for defaming our name. And that'd be some street yeah. nigga shit. That's, yeah. The street shit. Yeah, that's what that is. Now I'm, I'm a borderline extort you. Hey, interneters. Now, you, now that costs. No. You know when you're talking to somebody that's different? <laughs> Call me to negotiate because I didn't like that. Mm -hmm. You got to pay a fee. Hey, I won't play this apology here, but boy, was it humble. It was a great apology. But again, he recognized, he realized. Mickey Fax, smart guy. Yes, what's what Mickey I'm Fax, I keep trying guy. to say here. Shaheem Yo, ain't listen. got nothing he went better on drink. to do. He went on drink. <laughs> <laughs> hey, don't, hey, Shaheem, I, hey. Because I, I ain't talking to this nigga. Because he can't, I can't I get a word in right now with him. <laughs> what I'm saying is that's the goal of drink champs. Get you on there drunk and, now you and start. let you slip up. And Mickey then, Fax. I don't. That is no. That's the come goal. on, fam. Yeah, let's be real. No, let's be goal. real. That, that is the goal. That's, that's not that the goal. is the goal. I'm the arguing that. Wait, wait, wait. The goal is this. 
Um, once you not necessarily drunk, slip up, wait, but once you drunk, you'll tell the stories right? without the filter. Because your inhibitions know that this is hip hop. It's certain shit that should be left unsaid. But when you get drunk, now it's like, eh, fuck it. Minori, you get a little Nor- looser. When- Nori often will try to stop you. He often will try to stop. He's leading you there, but he's going to try and stop you from being foul. And if you no, say, no, 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 well, I don't want no foul and if, shit. And if he say, I'm- and if you say something foul, and you ask him to take it out, I think he'll take it out. I would think so. I think he will. I, I don't so, think so. he'll say. Yo, fuck you, dog. You said it is end. Now, yeah, on the flip care. side of that, in this game, they can't edit it if you don't give it to them. That's true. That's right. You said it. Mm-hmm. And you might have dapped niggas up and left. Because yep. a lot of niggas don't understand the power of the internet. That's or right. Repercussions. And a lot of people take for granted the people that might be listening to them. No, not just that. See, I I just, tell you, yeah, yeah, yeah. Niggas, some, we be talking about niggas, they be listening. Same shit with these niggas. Yeah. No, some niggas never got punched. Some niggas just come from a different walk of life, right? So it's a lot of times when we see shit on TV. Like, we'll see the Karens, right? Mm-hmm. And they'll just be saying... Matter of fact, we just saw it last week. We saw a white lady talking shit to a dude at a game. And he said, yo, get out my face. And she smacked him. Mm-hmm. And he beat her and her boyfriend up. And everybody looked at him like he was crazy. Still mm-hmm. a game, by the way. We come from a different neighborhood. Was it? Yeah, it was. Will you say certain shit, you overstepped the gun line. But some of these niggas be nerds that don't come from those neighborhoods and think that there are no repercussions behind what you say. You'll find out. Yeah. Hopefully you won't, but you could find out. All right. Internet people, here's another dead giveaway for you. Shaheem says, fuck out of here. We are the true and living seven. (sighs) And added everybody. Internet. True and living seven. He's saying he was here for he's a first seven. He's yeah, part of the, yeah. the originators. Original. That's, it's me. I don't day give one. a fuck what's happening. As y'all say day I one. started it. A God, seven people were here. <laughs> that's what he's saying. And that's my ignorant version of it, because I ain't I don't know. I know you should leave that person alone. Mickey Fax, glad you apologized. Glad you got it squared away. Nori, I'm minding my business. Do what you want. It's none of my business. You owe it. You owe G of mine. Who am I to tell you what to do? And you from Queens. Um, no, you got a resume. Yeah, I don't tell him. It's, it's, a, it's levels to this. Yeah, yeah, it's got, levels to this. Got. Nori got... Yo, I'm seeing rumblings out there that Webb is home. I'm seeing some things out there. I'm leaving it alone. But if my guy is home... Well, yeah, we in August. He was supposed to be home. I think Webb is home. I'm hitting a round of applause in case Webb is home. Shout out to Webb if he's home. I'm looking for you, buddy. It's a long time. Congratulations, man. I miss you and I love you. I'll get with you soon. I'll get with you soon. New Joe Biden. <laughs>